A function is defined as f of x equals 6x minus 36. And we need to evaluate it for these different variables down here on the bottom. So what we need to do to evaluate a function for a given value, we substitute that value in in place of x. What this function really says is that function f performed on x is 6x minus 36. So if we're going to perform function f on something else, that something else would be put in place of x on the other side. So first we have f of 2. So f of 2, if f of x is 6x minus 36, then f of 2 would be 6 times 2 minus 36. 6 times 2 is 12, minus 36 is negative 24. f of 0, we'd plug 0 in where x is, so we'd get 6 times 0 minus 36. And if we have 6 times 0, that's just 0. 0 minus 36 is negative 36. f of z would mean that we'd replace x with z, so we'd just get 6 times z minus 36. f of x plus 3 would mean that we need to replace x up here with x plus 3, so we'd get 6 times x plus 3 minus 36. And if you wanted, you could distribute that 6. You'd get 6x plus 18 minus 36. And then 18 and negative 36 could be combined, and you'd get 6x minus, what, 24? 8, 28, 18. <laughs> minus 18. All right, we got it. <laughs> minus 18. And then for our last one, e put it over here on the side and I'll change colors too so it doesn't get too confusing. Last one, E, we have f of 2r minus 1 so we'd get 6 times 2r minus 1 minus 36 and if we distribute that 6 now we get 6 times 2r that would be 12r and 6 times negative 1 would be negative 6 minus 36. Negative 6 minus 36 would be 12r minus 42. So f of 2r minus 1 would be 12r minus 42.